And it feels so good Oh yeah And it feels so good Oh yeah What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new, hey what's up? My name is Danielle. I post videos every Wednesday and Sunday about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, some weekend in my life vlogs here and there, and I like to hit the dab a lot, so um, just be ready. If you end up liking this video or any of my other videos, make sure to subscribe to join the Dan fam. Stick around, the subscribe button's down below. It's a fun time, and I love talking with you guys and creating this fun little positive community, so join the Dan fam. You really should. Anyways, summer is coming up oh so soon. As you guys are watching this, I'm about to embark on my exams. I have a couple of exams, and then my last day of school is Wednesday, June 1st, so I'm pumped. I'm pumped. I'm so excited. So comment down below what day you end school because I'm really curious. But anyways, today I'm going to be making my first kind of summer video, I suppose, and it's all about feeling good in your bathing suit, whether it's a bikini or a one piece. I'm hitting all the talking points. Um, just like little things that you can do right before you go out for the day in a bathing suit or or like the night before or just different things you can do for yourself because I just think it's so important to like feel good about yourself when you're in a bathing suit and I can I for one will tell you that I am I am not a hundred percent confident in myself when I'm in a bathing suit I I will get closer and closer to coming to terms with it it's taken me a while to get to the point to even feel good around people in my bathing suit because that's just how I am I'm very insecure or I was. I'm getting better with it because I've been doing things to feel good about myself. I'm going to be talking about a lot of different things. It's kind of an inspirational, fun video and also showing you guys a couple of my favorite bathing suits. So it's kind of a all-in-one kind of bathing suit deal. This is actually going to be a collab video with two of my best friends here on YouTube, Molly Bailey and Kenzie Elizabeth, two of my favorite girls ever. They're great people. They really are. So um, Kenzie is doing a morning routine and Molly is doing 10 things you're doing wrong in the morning. So I think both of those videos are going to be really fun. I love both of their channels a lot. They're two of my really, really, really best friends. So it would mean a lot for me if you guys went to go check out their videos. So their links will be down below. Make sure to subscribe to their channels while they're at, while you're at it. If you like my videos, you definitely like theirs. They're some of the most sweetest people I know and they just have like really good quality and content videos. So go check them out. And if you're new because you're from their channel, what's up? You should subscribe. <laughs> but anyways, this was a super long intro. I'm so sorry. I just had some caffeine, so I wanted to talk. All right, I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys right now. Let's go. Let's go. Woo! So I think one of the best ways to feel good about your body the day of, like you're going to the beach with some friends, that morning, go outside, put out your yoga mat, do some stretching or just some yoga. So I'm doing the downward dog. I'm just kind of stretching out my body so it's almost kind of leaning it out a little bit. Just stretching out all the bones and muscles so you're just really flexible and you just feel good. And I just love a good yoga morning session. You actually can get a really good workout from doing yoga. Um, so now I'm doing a little cobra and chattadunga. Just kind of waking myself up honestly. Um, and then you can also choose to do some workouts. I like to do very minimal. Maybe I'll do some cardio or like I did here. You'll see in a second I did some ab workouts because I mean you want to feel really good obviously um, when you're about to be in a bathing suit. So I think just doing some ab workouts, it's almost like a mental thing. Like you'll just feel much better. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just love working out the morning of maybe I'm about to go to the beach with friends or going to the pool or it just makes you feel good and push-ups are always great I did like three of these I swear like those are so hard you guys I give props to whoever can do those clap push-ups or you can always do things like cartwheels or burpees um, I like love burpees people hate them but I have so much fun with them and then when you get tired enough just <laughs> plop down and you'll feel like good and you'll be like okay I'm gonna go get my bathing suit on and head out the door a trick that my mom always taught me is the day before a few days before you're about to do something in your bathing suit bronze up go outside around the golden hour in your backyard like right before the sun's about to set when the sun is like at the perfect spot um, or just really any time of the day and just get a little base tan before you go to the beach with friends it will just make you feel a lot better when you put on your bathing suit or maybe every day after school for like like every other day after school like come home tan for 30 minutes make a little event out of it listen to some music relax read a magazine it's always so nice to just have that self-reflection time anyways and you're gonna tan at the same time
Next thing I think helps a lot is using a firming lotion or just any sort of lotion on the reg. Um, I love this one. It's called like bum bum cream and it's supposed to just firm up your skin and just make it look more toned. So that's always a plus. As for the day of, you might be being in your bathing suit. I really suggest drinking a lot of water. It will help with bloating and it will just keep your digestion system going and it will just make you feel a lot healthier in general. Speaking of bloating, stay away from those foods. No way, Jose. Try to eat some more less fattening foods that aren't gonna make you super bloated right before you go out. So maybe have a salad and then like an hour later have like some fruit or something or just have like smaller little meals and you'll be good to go. As much as I love watermelon, don't eat watermelon before you go out swimming because it makes you really bloated. I would know. <laughs> I'm sure you guys already know this, but one pieces are kind of the new thing and I'm really into them. This one is from a website called Kingdom, Kingdom and State and I absolutely love it. Um, I feel great in one pieces and if you feel more comfortable in one pieces, go for the one piece. And there's so many different stylish ones now that are super chic looking or more bohemian looking. It's really up to you and you just shouldn't feel limited to bikinis. And lastly, the biggest thing is you just need to own it. You need to be confident in yourself if you're treating your body right and you're living the healthiest lifestyle that you can for your life, then that's really all you can do. Body confidence doesn't come from trying to achieve the perfect body. It comes from embracing the body that you already have. So, I mean, I just think life is way too short to spend another day at war with yourself, at war with others about being jealous about their body. Just know that Confidence will make you happier than any sort of diet and you just need to love yourself for who you are at the end of the day I don't love my body completely either. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video I enjoyed making it for you guys. It was a little bit different So comment down below if you like this kind of video or if you have any other requests on videos like this or just Request some videos honestly like that'd be that'd be really awesome. That'd be a one Anyways, I love you guys so much and I hope you guys enjoyed this video Comment down below when you end school and any video requests give this video a thumbs up if you like it I never say that but like I feel like I need to say that I don't really know why everyone always says give this video a thumbs up So please give this video a thumbs up if you like it. I don't know. I don't know All right, I really need to go. I love you guys so much and I will see you guys this Wednesday for my next video I still wiggle. Bye. Dad. Okay